to the YouTubes, to the Johnnies, to the Sarahs. Tuesday morning, 9.03, late to work. I am sitting in my truck, letting it warm up, because if you don't, it will run like doo-doo. So I'm letting it warm up. I've got my, uh, it looks like coffee, but it's actually Dr. Pepper in there. Aha! Yep, got my Dr. Pepper. Ooh, bird. ADD, full swing. I'm ready to roll. I'm trying to get myself excited to go sit in an office all day. <laughs> ah, ah, ah. Trying. Try to, you go, gotta fake it till you feel it, I guess. Some, some stuff like that. Got a few things to do. Look over the lesson for Wednesday. Um, prepare for the fall, what I want kids' church to look like, and what I want Wednesday night Bible study for kids to look like. I've got some different ideas. Um, <clears throat> let me share this with you. Let me get some feedback. Uh, leave some, some comments below about what you think about this. So currently, on Wednesdays, it's not really... You can't see my eyes. It's not really Awana's, it's like an Awana style of a different program. But anyways, what they do is, they have necklaces, all the kids do, all the kids have necklaces, and they have a little name tag with their name on it, blah blah, my name is Herkins Mackin. But they get points, and they get beads for their necklace, if they bring their Bible, they memorize their verse, they bring back this worksheet that we give out, and if they wear their WOW shirt, and that's what Wednesdays are called, WOW, and that we have a t-shirt, and the end of the, their points, and then at the end of the semester, you have this big WOW store, and you cash in your points for Tinker Toys, yo-yos, weird sunglasses, you know, different things like that. And my thought is, I don't know that I want to continue to do the store for several different reasons. Um, one main reason I don't want to do it is it costs a lot of money to make the store awesome. Um, it takes a lot of money out of my budget. Uh, I've kind of noticed, like, if you wanted to have enough stuff for everyone and enough cool stuff for everyone, it really drains the budget. And the other thing I don't really like is the way it's designed right now, they come to WoW, they sign in, they get their necklace on, and then we go into a large group area and we sing one song, they go to their small groups, and then they take their necklace off and put it back on a stand. So they literally, out of the hour and a half night, they might wear their necklace 15 minutes. And I'm like, oh, is this really worth it? Is it? I just don't think it is. So my plan for the fall is to not do necklaces, not do the store, but instead, I want to give out dumb dumb suckers, the little dumb dumb suckers, if you have your verse memorized and focus on that. Really focus on Bible skills type of things like finding books in the Bible. And I want kids to have skills for the future rather than the current curriculum we do. It's a lot about just knowing different things like knowing some verses, knowing some Bible stories. And that's good. I agree with that. But I would rather a kid have Bible skills that are going to really stick with them as they get older. And as they go from children into the youth area, I want them to have Bible skills that they can have and use. And to me, that's a lot better than just knowing different things. Does that make sense? I would rather them have skills, Bible skills. That's what we're going to do in the, 
in the fall. I'm pretty sure. That's what I'm leaning towards. Bible skills, drills, and thrills. But, that's the ramblings of a children's minister right there. That's what I'm planning on doing. And I really want to do that sucker thing instead of the store. Because each week, you know, you say your verse, you get a sucker right then. And I think it's more tangible for kids to see. Especially if they didn't memorize their verse and they get to watch everyone else enjoy a sucker. There'd be more motivation for them. That's just kind of what I'm thinking. Because it's like, with the necklaces, you don't get to wear them for that long. And so not everyone looks at your necklace and they put it down. So there's not much competition with it. No healthy competition. Not that children's church is about competition or anything like that. But those are just my thoughts. Well, <clears throat> I'm currently nine minutes late to work. I think the truck is warmed up. So I'm going to peace out. See you later. Please leave me a comment below. Tell me what you think about what I'm saying. Please leave me a comment, please. Please, please. Let's have a discussion. Like, come on. Discuss with me what I've talked about. Bible skills, children's church. What do you think? What are your thoughts? What are your ideas? Hit me up.